What is up everyone, this is Mo Gaming here, and today I'm going to show you how to fix the PlayStation 5 cannot start the application error in 2021. So let's get right into this. So this is an error that happens on both digital and uh, disc type games, and I'm going to show you how to fix this. So we're going to start off with disc first. If it's the disc which you're trying to play, and it's turning it on and this error comes up, see if you can take out the disc, essentially clean it with a actual cloth, not a tissue paper or something, like an actual lens cleaning cloth, like something for your glasses or your phone. Use that to clean it and put it back in. A lot of times than not, that will fix the issue because it's possible there's like debris or dirt or something on the disc causing it to not be red causing it to not start uh, if obviously that didn't work you can always press the options button on your controller and do check for update because it's very much possible there's an update for the game which might need to be installed to essentially fix this issue if doing those and deleting and reinstalling doesn't work what you want to do next is you want to go into settings and you want to go into user and account so what you want to do here is a see if you can sign out if you count sign back in and try playing the game again Hopefully the error should not persist any longer, but if it still does, the next thing you can do is restore licenses. A lot of times it doesn't start because there is some form of licensing or networking issue just causing a issue from the Sony itself, not letting you essentially play those games. So it shouldn't really take long, depending on how many games you have. <coughs> I don't have a lot, maybe you do. But um, once you kind of do this, uh, try it out and go from there. If that still causes issues, the next thing you can actually do is if you go to where it says save data and game setting or in storage and go over to save data, as you can see over here, you can find whatever, whichever one, right? And you'll actually see the game that's causing you problems. Um, so I think it might be for PS4 games for me. You might actually be able to, 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 to I think I had, I thought I had it somewhere. Um, I know I have them in, it says six games. Uh, let's get, I, I want it cause I want to actually show you. So if we go to console storage over here from here, from the cloud, you'll see over here. So as you can see over here, the, it's, it's possible that maybe it's just one game. Let's assume it's Sifu, right? This is the one that's the problem. So you can actually, it's going to kind of suck. You can d delete these essentially. And once you do, obviously that's a problem, but you, you <laughs> because you're not going to have the file, but it's very much possible that it is the file itself. That's the issue. And it's corrupted. Hence why the game's not loading up because as soon as the game loads up, it, tr it loads these things into it. Hence why the it's possible possible that the corruption there is what's causing this to essentially fail so you want to kind of like take it into it delete it i, I know it's astral play right i don't care and you can kind of do whatever apply delete it it won't sync and that's it the game's deleted and you should hopefully not have that error persist any longer the final thing you can do is essentially turn off your console completely go into rest mode and rebuild your database clear the cache and see if that fixes the issue. Most likely, whatever I've mentioned should end up fixing your issues and you should not have them persist any longer. So yeah, that's basically it. Uh, if you guys still have any comments, questions, concerns, just let me know in the comment section below. I'm more than happy you guys out. If you guys overall like this video, please smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, click that notification bell, and that mugging out.